it turns out all Alfric is a cardinal, huh? Hard to imagine such an important figure getting abducted. And whoever took him somehow knows we have the chalice. I bet they know how to use the thing, too. I doubt they just plan to decorate their mantle with it. According to the legend that Elfric shared with us, the chalice has the power to bring back the dead. Are his captors hoping to resurrect someone? Hmm. Or perhaps they simply intend to sell it for an exorbitant payoff. Maybe. Who knows? Perhaps. The identities of the Cardinals are a closely guarded secret of the Church, yet Elfric's status was disclosed in that letter. Could this signal a power struggle within the church? Or perhaps that's what they want us to believe. Either way, we should pay close attention. We were hoping that Chalice would protect this, but it's the reason Elfric got captured. That's ironic. The people here really adore him. I'm sure they'd appreciate our help getting him back. Then again, are we getting too involved? Maybe we should leave before we make things any worse. Okay. Hey, Tara. It's gotten pretty dangerous around here, so we've sent all the children back to their homes. I hope Elfric's all right. The Ashen Wolves are strong, but I don't think even they can do this on their own. You'll lend them a hand, won't you, Professor? Please, save Elfric. Okay. Oh, man. me we can't expect to just mosey on by hand over the chalice and make it out alive nothing sounds better than saving elfric and roughing up the jerks who took him it's just well as the relentless king of grappling i'll be fine but i'm worried about hey terry does my webcam look all right i've been trying to fix it but it keeps screwing up really? elfric's been taken hostage who could do such a dishonorable thing? This stuff, Ash, always scares me. It doesn't matter. Abyss needs him. We've got to form a rescue party. I just hope we're not getting in over our heads. We don't exactly know what we're dealing with. Nothing. Hmm. were dicey for a bit there. Gotta say, I'm relieved that no harm befell anyone in Abyss. I've made sure that the elderly and children are hidden in their homes. They need to stay safe. Nothing right now, but I might call on you for a favor later. So that's the deal. People are safe for now. But I can't shake the feeling that something's just off. All we can do at this point is focus on the problem staring us in the face. We've got to get Alfie back. I was abducted once, when I was younger. My captor used me as a test subject in her twisted experiments. Maybe we can just give them the chalice and they'll release him unharmed. Might I have a word? It concerns the blackguards who abducted Alfred. I alluded to it before, but I sincerely believe there is a spy in Abyss. We are in agreement then? Yuri is exceedingly devoted to his friends. But there are times that he can be a bit too trusting. I see. Um, uh, maybe... Hey, uh, the leader of the group that took Elfric. I've seen him before. He wouldn't hesitate to slaughter an entire town if he stood to gain even a little by it. His laugh chills me to the bone. I have seen nothing. I have been here, in this place, where I always am. You cannot think it was me who did something. I am full of innocence. You did something. I was speaking with Happy earlier, and it dawned on me that she may possess a unique craft. Perhaps it's linked to the Four Apostles. If so, then in the chasm... No, there isn't enough to back that up. Hmm? Oh, sorry, Professor. I need to think on this longer before sharing my theories. Hey, you. Listen up. I've got something to report. And it's me. I... I'm a 
failure, a farce, an insult to the noble title of Abyss Keeper. Master Elfric's done so much for me. I wanted to pay him back one day, but instead, I let this happen. I'll never make this up to him. I'm disgusted with myself. Don't look at me, I'm a monster. Don't be so hard on yourself, dude. Jesus. It all happened so fast. They forced their way in and took Elfric. There was nothing I could do. We all wanted to fight. But Elfric stopped us. He always thinks of others first. Even if it means sacrificing himself. prominent figure in the church. If the Archbishop hears what happened, she might send the Knights of Serum and that'd make things complicated. Folks down here don't trust her. No. I need to fix all my weapons and armor and it's not even close. What do you require? Farewell. Welcome. I should have a whole bunch of bullions. Will this one do? That's Many better. Days. I wonder if anybody else has one. I feel like someone else still has a bullion on them. Yep. Will this one do? Many things. Will this one do? Will this one do? Many things. I need to repair my stuff. Come back soon. Now I have enough money to start, like, spending it on stuff. Is this it? There you go. 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 Um. Oh yeah, the iron bow is completely is busted. This it? There you go. Is this it? There you go. Is this it? There you go. I should see Come if there's any time. good weapons I should be Welcome. picking up. Eleven sword would be nice, but they never work. Not well, anyway. A killing edge? Uh, maybe. Actually, you would be great with a killing edge. Will this one do? Many thanks. Come back soon. Put these away. Take the killing edge. Do you... What are your ranks in... Your hidden talent is axes? Really? Huh. But it looks like you can use lances. Welcome. I might as well just give you a weak one. Yeah. Will this one do? Many things. I think you can use yeah, you definitely can use axes. Will this one do? Many things. I don't think you can use anything. Swords. Oh, you have the bare minimum for everything. Yeah, don't bother. Actually, wait a minute. Take bows. Will Flyers with bows Will are the most annoying do? thing in the Many world. Things. I might as well pick one up. Everyone else looks good though. Come back soon. 
Oh wait, uh, restoratives. Um. Welcome. This one. Buy a concoction, Thank please, you. just please in case. out there. Fewer injuries than I would have expected, and most were minor. I suppose the only conclusion we can draw is that they really were after Elfric all this time. Perhaps they were instructed to avoid unnecessary casualties. Is that Elfric guy really a cardinal? Are the secret cardinals really a thing? I thought that was a myth. Hard to believe. Did you folks in the Ashen Wolves know that? No, that's news to me. The identity of the Cardinals is top secret, even within the church. Huh. He never would have told us something like that. Well, except maybe Yuri. He and I talk about a lot of things. But right now, I'd say we have more important topics to discuss than his title. Alfred's been kidnapped. What are we going to do about it? Even if it is in the name of rescuing him, we simply cannot hand over the chalice to those scoundrels. Let's just give them the thing and be done with it. Professor! I came as fast as I could when I heard the report. I had no idea you'd be here. Is this loud, uh, excitable night a friend of yours? <laughs> you humble me, Professor. I'm Alois. I serve the church as a knight of Seros. Now, about Elfric's kidnapping. Since he's an important member of the church, we must use any means necessary to find him. That said, most of the holy knights have been deployed to deal with the Western Church. Sure, but any knights are better than no knights, yeah? I like your attitude, though I'm still embarrassed that we're not in full force. But hey, at least we're quite forceful. <sighs> Here, take this letter. We believe it was left by whoever kidnapped the cargo. In it, the enemy clearly spells out their plan. They're after a chalice that was hidden beneath abyss. A chalice? Hmm? A chalice? Hmm. Ah! Do you mean THE chalice? But no, why would it be there? I've never heard anything about it being stowed away in abyss. Then this is gonna come as a shock, pal. What in the goddess's name? Is that really the chalice from the legends? The probability of that is unassailably high. Yes. It was guarded by a bunch of giant creepy toys. There was powerful magic protecting it and everything. I saw it with my own eyes. If you say so. Wow. That means the story about the chalice being bound was true. Well, what's done is done. Oh, but I guess it's not done just yet. I must report this to Lady Rhea at once. Cindered Shadows. Betrayal. Uh-oh. <coughs> so that is what transpired. This is indeed the Chalice of Beginnings. It matches the descriptions and the few records of it that remain. Don't beat around the bush. What's our punishment? You removed a most sacred treasure. Truly, it is my obligation to mete out punishment for that transgression. However, you also helped the church locate a valuable artifact. In light of this good deed, I shall forgive the bad one. I do wonder. I am wondering whether your presence had anything to do with the artifacts unbinding, Professor. As per the Church Chronicles, the four apostles secured the chalice with powerful magic. The only way to release the chalice is by using the four crests passed down through their bloodlines. However, given the special power you possess, perhaps you were able to unlock it yourself. There is no knowing at present. For the time being, I will keep the chalice somewhere safe. As for Elfric, 
I assure you that the Knights will find and return him in due time. I consider him to be one of my many children, after all. I will not allow harm to befall him. Lady Rhea, might I ask a moment of your time? We cannot be expected to give up our endeavor. The enemy stated most clearly that if the Knights are involved, our dear Ulfric is finished. We owe him so much. If there is any possibility that his life is in danger, the risk is too great to chance. True. The Knights are strong and all, but they're liable to get him killed. We can take care of it, with Chatterbox's help. Our professor has the strength of a hundred Knights, or about one and a half of me. We've got this. How about it, Rhea? We've been through too damned much to get here. Leave the Chalice and Elfric to us. You won't regret it. Lady Rhea, please. Hmm. I'll take full responsibility. If you join your power with theirs, yes, perhaps there is hope. As you wish, I shall entrust you with the chalice. Your grace, the chalice is a legendary treasure. You can't just hand it over to those underground... That is quite enough. There is no cause to worry, I assure you. There will be no further discussion on the matter. Even if we lost hold of the chalice, it would be impossible for the thieves to make use of it. Though it was created to return a life that was lost, I doubt that anyone alive knows how to accomplish that feat. If someone were to successfully replicate the ritual, it would perhaps be the work of fate. All right. Hey boss, been meaning to ask. How'd you end up down here in Abyss? What is this? Some sort of interrogation? Yeah, you've never been big on sharing. I mean, you know all about me. And there's still so much I don't know about you. Look, I get it. Talking about the past isn't easy. But I'm curious, yeah? So get to it. I've got all day. Do you now? <laughs> well, I guess now's as good a time as any to tell you. I'm here because I killed some people from the church. That cannot be! Originally, I attended the academy as Count Rose adopted kid. There came a point when the church ordered me to wipe out some members from my old gang. They told me I was part of some important mission. Who is this old gang you speak of? They were nothing more than common thieves to someone like you, Constance. Anyway, they're like family to me. So naturally, I protested my orders. Things got pretty heated, and, well, the rest is history. That's some story, pal. You're damn lucky they didn't execute you. <laughs> You're telling me. Alfred stepped in and implored them to spare my life. Told them to consider the circumstances. It's not so different for the rest of you. I'm sure he helped all of us out in different ways. He did. I was about to be thrown in the monastery's underground jail. People thought I was dangerous, but with my gift and all. It's dark and dingy here, but it sure beats a prison cell. Alfie really saved my neck. Back to the point. Balthus, what was it you were so curious about? You had ideas regarding why our enemies may be clawing after the chalice, perhaps? No, nothing like that. But I am hung up on something Rhea said. That binding on the chalice was linked to the four apostles, yeah? I know I've got Chevalier's... Sorry, but mind if I cut in? What is it? Can't you see we're busy? I can, but I just remembered something. Something important. Specifically, the names of the Apostles, Oban, Chevalier, Noah, and Timotheus. The four Apostles whose bloodlines were lost to time. I figured the Ashen Wolves might have thoughts about all that. Uh, mm. No use hiding it now, Constance. Let's lay all of our cards on the table. As for me, I've got the major crest of Chevalier. When I enrolled at the Academy, the Church ordered me to keep that tidbit to myself. So I did. Mm-hmm. And I've got the major crest of Oban. Never did sort out how it is I have this thing. As for me, the blood of Saint Noah courses through my veins. This is kept hidden, even from the Empire. Which probably means mine's from Timotheus. I do have a vague recollection of being told my crest is rare. So the four crests, which were presumed lost, have all been gathered into the same house. All thanks to our buddy Elfric, it would seem. And now Elfric has been abducted. Why could that be? If it was the chalice they were after, they could have stolen it from us without the need for anything sly. Maybe someone had it out for him. 
Or maybe he messed around with the wrong people. Or it could just be unrelated entirely. We're trying to untangle this mess by tying more knots into it. I mean, Balthus, you landed here on accident, didn't you? It's not like that's linked to the rest of us. You know, I could just as easily have never ended up down here, you know? We're jumping at shadows. Anyway, we don't have time for this. Let's get our act together and head to the chapel ruins. Alright. Just glad it's Friday. Professor. Wait, what the heck? We go to all that trouble bringing Lady Rhea a priceless artifact and not so much as a thank you? We had to release the binding and everything. Well, I mean, it kind of released on its own, but still. Let's wrap this up and head home so I can get some quality sauna time. Hilda needs a steaming. The four apostles. Finally, it makes sense. I never understood why my village was hidden away from the rest of the world, but now I finally get it. What a relief. Ah, my head skipper now. We just need to focus on... I know it's been one crisis after him. Is Elfric an enemy or an ally? He's worked tirelessly to protect Abyss for years and years. Yet, had House Nouvelle not met such a terrible fate, I would never have come to Garrick Ma, and Noah's bloodline would never... Can his kidnapping really be a simple coincidence? I suppose it's all out in the open. Now you know just what I'm capable of. The church would have destroyed me ages ago if it wasn't for a certain someone having my back. My life was spared. Huh. I can't believe my wild hypothesis was correct. I may not look it, but I'm shocked. It's like casting a line and thinking you've landed the big one. But then you reel it in, and it's set it. Okay, that was a weird analogy. The point is, I'm very, very shocked. And so, to be honest, I'm surprised Lady Rhea was so willing to just hand over the chalice like that. Doesn't the church consider it important? I know she said they wouldn't be able to use it, but something doesn't feel right. You're telling me these people are creeping me out. Oh God, he's invisible. But you're from the surface too. Maybe only some surface people are the worst. Anyway, good luck. The Ashen Wolves can take on anything. They'll make sure it all turns out okay, won't they? Yeah. Because I'm here. Yuri somehow always keeps his cool. He's closer with Elfric than anyone. So he's got the most reason to be upset. I'm sure he's just really good at hiding the same feelings we're all having. What do you require? Oops. Farewell. I already went through all the shops and stuff, so it's just a matter of talking to everyone. Lost crests? Elfric's objective? Since our journey's outset, the mystery has only deepened. Ah, please. Forgive for now. Really? The descendants of the four of to think that their bloodlines carried on in secret. Right under our noses. One was even disguised as Imperial nobility. House Nouvelle was thought to be descended from Saint Macula. But that was a fabrication. How did they manage to avoid detection for so many generations? Huh? Those lost crests. They must all have their own relics, don't you think? Uh, but before we dig into a new mystery, we better figure out the ones we're already working on. I have a theory, but actually scratch that. No use guessing when our answers await at the chapel ruins. Hey! Hey you, listen up. I've got something to report. Nah, tried it on, doesn't feel right. In any case, about Master Alfred. Bring him back to us, okay? For my part, I'll look after things down here. If our enemy shows up, I'll stay by. <laughs> Please. Maybe you think this is a bad time to talk about what we drink down here. 
But I'm gonna anyway. See, the problem isn't in the local ingredients. It's what's getting shipped in that's the issue. With the right equipment, we could probably make our own. Cut out the need to import anything. Hell, maybe we could even export some of it. As soon as Elfric's back, I'm gonna see what he thinks of the idea. So, uh, make sure Elfric comes back safe, all right? Okay. If the church knows that Elfric's been abducted, I know you're all doing We can't. Oh, my. Elfric dies. This won't matter too much for an old codger like myself. But the kids, it'd be hard to see their hopes for the future crushed. Hey! <sighs> there is danger here, because... We could be attacked. But the same danger is there for me on the surface. The only way to leave the danger is to disappear. No. First, we save. I don't want to spend any more money right now. Wait, hold on. I want to do one thing. One thing. Dang it. Actually, wait. Yeah. Okay, now I'm good. This chapter and then hey, two Fred. more. Let's not deny that there's a connection between us. How about you and me have ourselves a little date, huh? I'm... <laughs> it only happens when I'm being a little greedy. When the bell strikes midnight. Meet me out front at the Holy Mausoleum. My only condition is that you arrive promptly after midnight. And not a moment before. What say you? It's the most romantic time of the evening, of course. Or is the idea of a date with me not appealing to you? <laughs> Nobles have nearly killed one another fighting for my affections, you know. Perhaps you won't get all you want out of me. <laughs> but I'll promise you a fun time regardless. I'm it's settled. I'll see you tomorrow night, friend. Don't stand me up. Uh, excuse me? What? Your Grace, please reconsider. The chalice is among the church's greatest treasures, akin to even the hero's relics. I am well aware. You consider this the hero's relics are fearsome weapons imbued with great power. On the contrary, the Chalice has long lost the power it once. If that is so, then why is it still considered such an important artifact? It was created for a sacred purpose. To use the blood of the four apostles to return the goddess to our world. Their blood. Your grace, is something the matter? I have an urgent mission for you. Investigate the origins of the Ashen Wolves. Start with their enrollment forms for the Academy. Keep an eye out for falsified documents. Yes, of course. Understood. Before you begin, summon Alois at once. I have new orders for the Knights as well. As you wish, Your Grace. If I am correct, we haven't a moment to lose. Another tragedy is soon to transpire. Oh no. Crumbly old chapel somewhere nearby. Or... I can play a little part here, save perhaps as a bargaining chip for our dear Alfred. Getting yourself captured instead? That wouldn't be good at all, Constance. I think we should be more worried about B's appearance. I mean, he's got way, way more uh, 
life experience than the rest of us. And all that life experience makes you look more like a knight than a student fee. You saying I'm old, pal? Don't forget, you're speaking to the ageless king of grappling. She's not wrong, Balti. There's a pretty big age gap between you two. You're friends with Helda's older brother, right? That explains your maturity. You make Hubert look like a spring chicken. Can it, will ya? Anyway, I'm wearing a school uniform. No way in hell they'll think I'm a knight. Yeah, and anyone wearing a school uniform is without a doubt a student. To be honest, for a good while, I actually did think you might be a knight. Who made your uniforms and set up the Ashen Wolf House, anyhow? If I might so humbly interject, that would be Alfred. He pulled everything together for us. Sometime after he was appointed as the Guardian of the Best. Said he wanted to give former students who were expelled from the Academy somewhere to live. Somewhere to belong. Of course, all of this was established long before any of us were in the picture. I doubt, doubt. Perhaps. After hearing all of that, it's not as unbelievable as I thought. All I know is that he helped me, so I'll help him. I strongly doubt that I shall factor into Alfred's retrieval. But I shall follow your lead. There it is. We owe Elfric. Maybe your goddess doesn't care about debts, but my fists and I sure do. Sorry to have roped you into all this, friend. What a pal. The Ashen Wolves really landed an A-plus professor. Not just on paper, but in practice, too. This is great. That's me ready to get to it and start hitting things. Ever since I was a kid, I've lived my life by one rule. That I'd only play my hand if I was guaranteed victory. I've gotten this far by using my cunning in any way necessary. Lying, cheating, even killing when there was no other way. But this next play? Well, the odds don't exactly seem to be in my favor. Not unless you trust me enough to provide me with an ace. Never mind, friend. Let's just go. No, don't save. The siege in the chapel ruins. <laughs> At last you've arrived. You certainly took your sweet time. My flock, why have you come? Save you, of course. You didn't really think we'd just up and abandon you, did you? If I may be so bold, we have the chalice you seek. Might I humbly request that you return, Alfred? You found the chalice? When I told you of it, I never imagined you'd... Let's make sure it's not some cheap imitation. Hand it over. Not until you hand over the hostage. There needs to be some degree of a trusting exchange here. I can see you don't understand your own predicament. We've no issue killing the lot of you and taking it either way. I can't tell if this guy's ears are stuffed with wool or if he's just this stupid. Can't say I'm surprised. Thugs like this aren't about to show us any gesture of sincerity. Yuri, stand down. Leave me. Take the chalice and flee. You must. It is irreplaceable. You must not hand it to these brigands. <laughs> you know us better than that. We didn't come here without a plan. Do your thing, Happy. Wait, do what thing? Seriously? Right now? Uh, no, Happy! Fine, fine, fine! <sighs> Versailles, she... <laughs> I've gotta say, that sigh of hers never gets old. Yeah, yeah, glad you like the show. It's not like it's a gift I asked for. Uh, where did that thing come from? <laughs> Absolute cowards. How entertaining. Balthus, will you do the honors? Leave it to me, boss. I got... Damn! <laughs> hey, Balthus, quit scoring around. Oh. Wow. I flew off of him. Now I'll sort it out. At least we... Cheap party tricks! Let's make these children scream! Well, this should be fun.
Uh oh. Level 35? Jesus. There's so many armor knights everywhere. Are these tricksters? Oh, heroes. I'm not liking how this is looking. Your reckless actions could have been the death of you. Don't go thanking me yet. <laughs> There's no... We must complete the mission the noble gave us. We shall... Didn't mind brawling a giant bird, but oh well. Time to show what happens. The sun. He's got such a small movement range. And he's a monk at level 34. Great. All he has is the Bal Balganone Tome, really? Nothing else? Oh, he's got lances on him. I will prevail. Oh, there's mages there. I didn't even see them. Yikes. Stay focused. This ain't gonna be good. I can feel it. In my bones. None of you have any dumb swords, right? Silver, 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 silver. Should just use swords. Who, me? Give it my all. Ready and willing. Um, actually. How do I want to play this? Sure this thing. is not a good place to be. Oh, there are two arrows. That mage can't reach. Oh, it's the... right now
expected. Ugh. Battle. Alright. Let's see what happens. I should just fight this bird. Oh, I got a crit? Really? Okay. These guys are all gonna hit like trucks. I'm surrounded. This ain't gonna be good. Unexpected. I need like some top tier gambits here. That should work. They seem right for defeat. The fight continues. Yes. I have so far left to go. Use caution. Um, I think I could probably. I don't like where I'm at right now. This is not good.
I wonder if I could... Hmm... What if I have 2 billion IQ? Stand here. Easy peasy. You're not going to be able to move up here, so it's fine. Hmm. This is such a clusterfuck. Perfect. Uh oh. The mage is less trouble than the fucking thing. This might be a good idea or a really bad idea. Um, what if I... No, they'll hit me. Okay. Idea. No. Whoop. Night Kneeler, Steel Lance. No one in this area can move but this mage, so I should be okay if... Actually, I'm gonna make it a little bit even- I'm gonna make it even safer. I don't like this. Actually, you should be all right right here. Thanks. This is going to be like bad, bad. I can feel it. Oh, thank God it missed. Okay, I might have a chance at living now. Get defense. Yes. It's a long road yet. Adorable. <laughs> Face it, I'm better than you. Oh no. Reinforcements. Backup. 
Hmm. I just need to... I need him to die. Or else I'll just keep summoning mobs back. No, these guys are all too strong. Oh, wait a minute. Helm Splitter. Helm Splitter Steel Axe? No. Should be able to. Wait, I think you have a gambit here. You do. Should be able to just smash. Nope, I'm one off. Two off. No one really needs healing this turn. Too weak. You're gonna heal Dimitri then. Yeah, I'm great. You move here. Yep. I may as well win. Must be awful losing to me. Speed and luck. I expect no less. No less. Get rid of this mage. That's how it goes. That archer's on a ballista, aren't they? This is a ballista. Kill him. He has to die. Um. My flyers definitely cannot reach him. Nope. Come on, get good level ups. Nice. I must keep aiming higher. God, I missed both. That was not in the plan. Sorry, but victory is mine. Bolting. Why am I freaking out? Just fly up here. Dang it! Ah! 
no biggie. Oh, that's a big gamble. No, not more reinforcements. Oh my god! Sometimes I wonder about my sanity when playing this. Just go away. Too reckless. I'm getting again. Oh, they're all staggered now. That's nice. Yep. Didn't you hear? I'm dangerous. Could have been better. Ninety nine MVP obtained for the chapter. Sure thing. Nice. Don't forget who you're dealing with. Oh, that's a great level up for a trickster. Dang it. Ooh. Get me out of here. Strong enough. It's good to be king. Dang it. I thought she'd be able to at least touch him. Oh, 
I got this. An 84 and I miss? Okay, game. I see how it is. You, you be you. That's why I have two people over here. Nice money. Stay focused. Should I have held back? I'll give it my all. I think I should just head south and then I should just ignore the top left. Wait, what's he got on him? A if it was an item, I wouldn't care, but now I do. Do you still have, oh, do you still have both of your boltings? If so... Come on, get a crit. Nope. I just gotta hit him one more time. What are the odds of this mage hitting me? Oh, that's... Not great. Wait, what if I... What if I'm really smart and do this? Canto back. Face it, I'm better than you. Canto. Not bad. The tables are turning. Just use a concoction. This over yet. I am deeply sorry that you got involved, please. Just for Oh my god, I didn't even think you could climb up those stairs. Oh my god, I can't believe they landed a hit from there.
I'm getting lucky with these. They're gonna keep me busy for a while. Oh, thank God, I guess. Thing. Axe wielders. Not too shabby. Stay focused. Expected. Come on, get something good. That's not we bad. Must all do our part. Yep. I'll give it my all. Careful. I don't like this. Nice. That was tough. I never doubted you. Break it down. Nice. That's what I wanted. Thank you. Sweet. 
sweet. I'm gonna win. Maybe. They can reach. I should have checked them a little bit. That worked out. I will prevail. Well, how was that? Stay focused. Thing. Dang it. Hmm. I shall try to play my part. Don't wait up. 
perfect. That's a nice level. It's a long road yet. Yobo. Yes. The fight continues. There we go. Someday, forgive me. Uh oh. Oh, there we go. Yeah. 
very helpful. <laughs> Can it be Princess Eight of God? Huh. How dare you disrespect House Restbell? This ends here. <laughs> 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 Whoa. Wow. Only a few left. There we go. I sped a week into their demise. Just a few more moves, then all will know that I am the Empire's. <laughs> Forget I said anything. Then again, if you die, it won't matter either way. <laughs> Mind pain, but it's time to make my exit. My employer pays me more than this treasure is worth. You okay, Elfric? I am. All thanks to you. The chalice. Is it unharmed? Yes, it's safe. Chatterboxes. What? Nighty night. What? Scoundrel, what are you doing? <laughs> I think you can see what I'm doing, Balthus. Beautifully executed, Yuri. The chalice is finally mine now, along with the blood of the four apostles. It seems I was correct that there was an enemy in our midst. To think our bird was instead a rat. You've always had a wild imagination, Constance. <laughs> I've got to say, turning your attention elsewhere was a challenge, even for me. That is enough for the banter, Yuri. 
I informed you not to divulge too much. They'll all be under the dirt soon enough. It's not like they'll be able to talk at that point. After all I've gone and done for you, Alfred, I would think you'd have just a bit more faith in me. Your silence speaks volumes. <sighs> yes, this is the end of the niceties. It's all on you now, friend. I'm sure you and the others will figure it out. Professor! Are you injured? I see you're well enough to make light of a serious situation. But surely you suffered a wound. Teach, there's no time for playing around. Tell us how... Ah, I get it. He only pretended to attack you, didn't he? So you were just playing a part in this grand performance. But was that really the smartest decision here? The Chalice and the Ashen Wolves are gone. I am loath to think what will become of them without our help. And how do you propose we pursue them? We haven't a clue where they went. Well, we know what they're after. That at least narrows down the possibilities. Professor, are we too late? Yes. Lady Rhea, why have you come? After sending all of you off, I began to investigate the lineage of the Ashen Wolves. In doing so, I was able to confirm that the documented information about their crests was falsified. What was once a wild speculation, I now know to be true. The crests they bear are the same as those of the Four Apostles. Once the blood of the Four is poured upon the chalice, I believe we have enough evidence to assume that our Ashen... So, Ulfric's aim must be to carry out the Rite of Rising at the expense of the students. Lady Rhea, what precisely is the purpose of this ritual? We've heard it has the power to resurrect life, but that can't be true. The chalice is a holy artifact, created by the goddess. So those wild tales are true. It really can bring someone back to life. Not exactly. It can breathe life into a body, but it cannot return a spirit that has already departed. Ultimately, it is a tool to return the goddess to her physical form. Her spirit is omnipresent, but her flesh is no more. Such incredible power is truly awe-inspiring. And... Extremely dangerous. For this reason, the four apostles were never intended. The Ashen Wolves are now gathered together, making it possible once more. And Elfric is at the center of this mess, luring them all to Abyss for his own selfish reasons, without so much as a whisper of it to the church, of course. This incident is my own doing. I never should have entrusted the chalice to them. Lady Rhea, do you have any idea where they could have gone? I do indeed. Garrick Monk which is protected by the god. Holding such a ritual requires absolute focus. So I am... There are countless such places within the monastery walls. The Holy Mausoleum. It's certainly peaceful there, but due to last month's incident, it's heavily guarded at present. For now, let us return to the monastery. There is much to consider. <sighs> Lady Rhea! You look troubled, Alois. What has happened? <sighs> Thieves have breached Garrick Mark's village walls. They've been pillaging the shops and residences, taking whatever they please. I wonder if this has anything to do with Elfric. There's no telling. But for now, their numbers are too great. They need the knight. By your will, Lady Rhea, allow us to clear the village of these hooligans. Yes, Marquis. Please ensure the safety of the villagers immediately. However, leave a few of your best knights here with me. Yes, Your Grace. I'll see to it. Teach? You look like you've got something to say. He told you to meet up with him at the Holy Mausoleum? You never re I'm certain that Yuri had his reasons for setting up this meeting. He took the time to speak with you. How Fair point, Dimitri. I do wonder why he told you it needed to be after midnight. Wouldn't it be better to rush to their aid immediately? Yuri's no fool. There's a method to his madness. Two more chapters. Ugh. Cindered shadows, return to me. None. No. Where the heck are we? Finally. 
all awake. Good morning, sleepyheads. Or